What's going on everybody, I'm Good Entertainment Gaming here today bringing you some news, information, and updates surrounding Turtle Rock Studios' new video game, Evolve. Now, for those of you out there who don't know, Evolve is being published by 2K Games and originally was from the creators of Left 4 Dead, and as of right now, Evolve officially has its first trailer entitled Happy Hunting. Now, in the trailer, guys, it depicts the entire team of four, uh, made up of several unique characters, several unique classes, those characters being Griffin, uh, Markov, Val, and Hank. Uh, we saw them within the wilderness being descended from a plane, and pretty much they were searching around the area trying to find uh, whatever it is that caused the whole shabacle down on the planet. And being that Val is a medic, Markov is assault, Griffin is a trapper, which is very unique, and Hank is the support, each set of classes will be very different, and eventually, to their surprise, uh, they encountered exactly what they were looking for, which was a 40 foot goliath of a beast what's really cool however about each and every single player you choose to play as will be equipped with a jetpack so you don't have to worry so much so about running jumping crawling or anything like that um it will give you a boost letting you know quickly on when exactly the jetpack is going to expire and whatnot uh the monster within the game is naturally much bigger and much faster than the players so turtle rock studios thought it would be really cool to include a jetpack that way can actually assist you during these epic battles um those are all the characters pretty much for the game but eventually evolve will come down to more of a team-based oriented battle that's pretty much what evolve is it's a team-based oriented battle you can't do much without the other significant on your side um now the understanding goes as follows there will be other enemies within the game as well but your main focus are going to be the beasts that lie within the game itself now the game is scheduled for 2014 and like always People are wondering, what can you do, what can't you do? Although there is much information that is being kept from Turtle Rock Studios, we do know that you're able to play as the Goliath in the game. Now, there are going to be checks and balances for that. You can't just play as the Goliath and expect to just crush the other team. Uh, like I said, the other team has a very unique arsenal of abilities and weapons. For example, Hank, who is a support class, has the ability to be invisible. So that's just another unique uh, you know, feature that these characters have. These characters aren't just regular people with regular weapons. They have unique abilities, jetpacks, invisibility cloaks, you know, bombs and medic classes. So you're actually going to be using a very unique set of people within the game, as well as the monster. If you're going to be playing as the Goliath, you're able to breathe fire, you're able to maneuver much faster than the humans, and you're able to jump along with so many other abilities. The more you eat, the more you grow, and the more you grow, the more powerful you become. So the game is set for the Xbox One, PS4, and PC. And the game honestly looks really, really good. Um, some people might say that the graphics aren't as good as uh, they should be. But overall, the game looks very, very impressive. Now, from the uh, regular character's point of view, you will be playing as a first-person point of view. If you're going to be playing as the Goliath, you will be playing in a third-person point of view. But the Goliath in his first evolution is very, very weak. He's able to pretty much climb anything within the game, jump anywhere and do anything. Now, what's really unique is the fact that you can't really give away your position if you're beginning to disturb the wildlife around you. The hunters will pick you up and they will try to kill you. So your overall objective while you're playing as the Goliath is to just feed on anything you can possibly feed on in order to grow. That is the process. So the more you eat, the better you are to evolving and the more likelihood for you to evolve into your final form and then fight the humans. Uh, pretty much you don't just fight in one specific area you can go anywhere within the game and I think that's very very unique because you can eat other civilians and other creatures while uh, you know the players try to kill you so uh, evolve guys is scheduled for late 2014 so let me know what you guys think about evolve in the comment section below do you guys think evolve will be better than left for dead or do you guys think the left for dead is going to be better than evolve uh, let me know in the comment section below everybody thank you all for watching my name is Unv Entertainment gaming if you guys are evolved fans don't forget to subscribe to my channel for all the latest evolve news information and updates if you guys enjoyed the video please hit it up with a like and a favor rape that thumbs up button guys stay tuned for more evolve news check out my previous episodes and i'll be seeing each and every single one of you guys in the next video are you going to be getting evolved let us know guys peace